How's it going, my fellow Vault Dwellers? And today, we have some new updates on the upcoming Fallout TV series. I know it's been a while since the last time I made an update on the show, but we got some brand new images and a new video to look at, and as well as I'll review a few of my thoughts on the images. But enough wasting your time, let's get right into it. Now, before we go any further, I do want to give credit to the Reddit user Prince Decat for uploading these photos to Reddit. So starting off with this first image, it looks like we're right outside some sort of vault tech facility. And here's just a little bit of background information on the photos. So these photos were taken back in December of 2022 and it appears that the location is at a hospital. But yeah, so we can see what looks like a factory in front. And of course, the obvious thing that we see here is the giant vault tech sign that's painted on the ground. So leaving me to believe that this is some sort of vault tech research lab or maybe a hospital. I don't know. All I know is that we got some exciting photos to take a look at. So let's move on to the next one. All right, so here we can see a little bit below us, and now it looks like we got a film crew and a couple actors right down below on the staircase of the entrance. And the entrance down by the actors is painted, and the entire room past the entrance and the hallways outside the room are also painted. And apparently a lot of those rooms are locked, so leaving the Reddit user to believe that there's a possibility of them coming back to reshoot some indoor scenes. But aside from that, looks like we have a couple film crew members and a couple actors here. And if we're to zoom in on the actor right here, and it looks like we have a familiar outfit here, to me, this definitely looks like a Brotherhood of Steel character. I mean, you can't deny that this looks like a scribe outfit from the Brotherhood of Steel faction. And if you've seen my previous Fallout leak videos, there was a character who I assumed that was a Brotherhood of Steel character that looked like they had the same outfit on. So I think it's further confirming that Brotherhood of Steel is making an appearance in the series. But I gotta ask the question, what are your thoughts? Do you think it looks like a Brotherhood of Steel character? Let me know. And onward to the next photo. So it looks like we got a couple pictures of the vehicles on set, but I gotta be honest, I'm not quite impressed by the look of the vehicles yet. I'm not sure if they're planning to do some CGI in post-production to kind of make it fit more the aesthetic, but to me, it just looks like a beaten down old rusted car, but it doesn't quite have that, that, that fallout aesthetic, you know what I mean? But I'm not gonna lose hope yet because I still believe they're gonna pull it off somehow. And it looks like we have a couple film crew members off to the side, but the most important thing we're seeing in this image is the vehicles of Fallout. But if we zoom in on the van, we can see the logo of a Hawthorne Medical Laboratories, a division of vault Tech Corporation, which I had to look up on the Fallout Wiki because I haven't heard of this before. But according to the Fallout Wiki, it is a medical research company that's a subsidiary of vault Tech Corporation that appears in some capacity in the Fallout television series. So that is going to be very interesting. And I want to know your thoughts on this because it sounds interesting to me that we're going to be hearing about a brand new company that hasn't been talked about in any of the Fallout games, according to my knowledge. And what do you think about Hawthorne Medical Laboratories? And what do you think the agenda of this company is on behalf of vault -Tec? Let me know in the comments down below. And the last thing I wanted to show before I wrap up today's video is some film and crew members just walking around the set. I mean, nothing really exciting or necessarily new compared to the first image that we looked at, but I just wanted to bring this in here because it was all uploaded from the same Reddit user. So again, shout out to Prince the Cat for uploading these photos and giving us a bit of an update because we haven't heard from anything in a while. And I know a lot of you were getting a little concerned, especially with the writer strike going on. So it's nice to see something, although we still don't know when we can expect a trailer, but hopefully we could get something soon to excite the fans. But that's about everything I got for today's video. So what are your thoughts? Are you excited about the new leaked photos? Is it getting you excited for the Fallout TV series? Let me know in the comments down below. And I just want to say thank you all so much for watching. And consider subscribing to the channel for Fallout news updates and content. And I'll see you all in the next one. But until then, have a good one.